We're all going off to drop our ballots off in the ballot drop box at Hannah Moore School and trying not to back into the car across the street at the same time. I did actually mark my ballot for Joe Biden. I still feel a little sick. I was tempted to vote for the Bread and Roses Party, which is a socialist candidate who's only running in non-swing states and is also local to Maryland, living in Silver Spring. But I didn't because fuck Trump. So here we're going, all of us. Here is my card signed, sealed, and delivered. Uh, there's an inner seal and an outer seal. The outer seal, the outer seal here, inner seal here. In between, you can't see it, is my signature. And you can uh, track your vote online or more accurately track your ballot, not your vote. The vote is anonymous. So we've got about a three minute drive. Uh, does anyone else want to make a comment for posterity? This is going on my blog. A voting we will go. A voting Please stop. Please stop, Mom. <laughs> uh, Nat? Yeah? It's a camera. You're an actor. Please Say stop. Say something. <laughs> It's sort of like, it's sort of like, okay, fine, Biden, but this is bullshit, you know? Like, that's, 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 I think that's how we're all feeling. Uh, fuck Trump, yes. Yeah. So now we're about to pull into Hannah Moore Center and Park, where the Hannah Moore School is, where Hannah Moore Park is, and where the ballot drop box is. I'm assuming it'd be the same place as where the uh, votes are normally held. Ah, yes. There's your drop. There's a sign. It says drop box. Yep. Oh, yep. Well, we're already in the car. Um, uh, take a quick pick. There are two other cars that are here to drop off ballots. So, uh, and also someone from BSI Security. Oh, that's just probably the guard, yeah. Yeah, that's yeah, the guard. Because they monitor the ballot box to make sure that people don't tamper with it. And it says Stop. on the box, any tampering with the ballots or a ballot drop box is a crime. Okay, I just realized that, like, I, we, I just, like, caught on the video uh, footage of that one person going in. I need to help her. She's going around in circles. Okay. Now we're all going around in circles this election um, cycle. <laughs> um, but, like, since, since I caught, like, on video the person putting it in the uh, Dropbox, is that, like... Uh... No, that's, that's, like, filming someone in line to vote. Okay. You're not revealing their vote. You just know that they voted. They did. Okay, I just like wanted to make sure I'm not like breaking any laws with that. All right. Uh, okay. Um. Uh, okay. Okay. So now I drop in the ballot. No muss. No fuss. Oh jeez, is that a master lock? The, the brand of uh, lock, I mean. Yeah, I believe so. Whatever it is, don't play with it. And we have now securely voted. Oh, camera back. Now that we now that we have voted, I am sorely sorely tempted to stop at Cure Leaf and get some weed because I just voted for Biden. <laughs> One of the interesting things is there were about four or five people who voted while, or either before 
we voted or while we were pulling away. So there are a lot, and, and this is still more than two weeks before the election, so we are talking about a lot of people voting early. Uh, of course, this is Maryland where they don't make it particularly difficult to vote early, um, as opposed to, say, for example, the People's Republic of Texas. The People's Republic of Texas is voting right now. Yeah. I, we have friends who actually put their vote into a drop box. But, so that's that, and no, I'm not actually stopping at the marijuana dispensary because I need to get stuff done at work. Actually at home, but I'm working from home because it's a Tuesday. Oh my God, it, it is two weeks. Yes, dear. It is. Exactly oh, exactly two, two weeks. weeks. Yeah. And next week starts early voting. You, well, early voting is in person as opposed to early voting by mail or in a yeah, drop box. Yeah, yeah I think you can okay. cut the taping off.